Hi there and welcome back to the Dark Queen of Kryn. I'm Byron and in the last video we um, actually found our way out of the Hold of Hook Folk Wood and we returned to Christopher and then met Sala for a last time. We dropped a few items in the Imperial Bank and now we can actually leave. As Hala has left, I know. Apparently she left with her husband for good. She didn't tell us she has a had a husband, but hell, whatever. Okay. It's time to move on. So we move down here. I will ignore those two settlements for now. I will go to this one first. Tall marsh grass slows your progress through the swamp. The Blackwater Glade you enter? No. Keep in mind that this is here. So if you go one um, step below the city of New Orem, and then we can get to the Blackwater Glade, this is important. The swamp, swamp bog is too deep for you to pass. Shambling mounts attack. Oh, really? Where are they? We need fire against them, if I remember correctly. Okay, they are down here. Four of them. Up here is nobody. Oh, they are up here too. How unfortunate. I think because of symmetry's sake, there are only to the northeast, uh, northwest, and the southeast. You yell. <clears throat> that seems to work. Okay, I think you should stay here and guard. Done. Cast <coughs> my delayed blast fireball. Let's see. Uh, the range is sadly uh, not as large. One, two, three. That's as far as we can go outside, I think. Wait, that didn't do anything. I'm I'm, I'm confused. Champing mods, I thought. Fire was... oh no, fire was against those puddings. Ice storm, magic missile and ice storm. Oh well. <coughs> I had forgotten that. Move it. Done. Guard. You delay a bit. So you go down here. Oh. 
Let's see, where are they? Two of them are here. I think she will be using uh, magic missiles against those bastards. <clears throat> Maybe she can take out one. Not quite. Oh, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have hit escape. Done, aim, next, this one. Missed. Well, done, aim, manual, um, you are hurt already. You cast another magic missile on this one. Good riddance. Then you also cast a magic missile. Why do you only have four magic missiles, I wonder? Well, manual. Fuck! Done. Aim. Manual. Can I see you? Yes, I can see you. Good. That's what you get for attacking Zara Whites. Are you going somewhere? I don't care. Good night. I'm back to you. Done. What do we have? 45. You're dead. Done. Oh. Done, I said. End. I don't think you need to cast any more spells. Fuck off. Where is everybody, for fuck's sake? Excuse me? Oh, more to the north west. Done. End.
Okay. Good riddance. Well, those battles in those large areas are always <laughs> troublesome. Uh, not really difficult, but annoying. If I save, rest. I'd rather fight indoors where, first of all, the range of my fireballs is larger. A fisherman volunteers to sail you across the straits in his boat. Will you go with him? Yes, we will. You sail across the straits. Fuck off. And uh, you don't have to walk that far in a battle. The village of Bayo. Do you enter? Yes, that's actually where I wanted to go. So, um, where do we go from here, I wonder? Hurry up, you still doesn't work. Fuck off. So there's a little hut here. As you enter the small hut, an old old sailor jumps up from a stool by a small table. So, what may I be wanting? We are friendly. Ah, you're not in league with these shark men, as they call themselves. That much I can see or hear, if you take my meaning. Those... Louts couldn't speak polite if their lives depended on it, as I hope one day they do. Hmm, my name is Eric, Eric Strongbond. And who are you, outlandish folk? Introduce yourselves. So you're some sort of heroes, then. Well, that's good. This town could use a hero or two right now, but you actually have six. That Oleg's been praying to strange gods for years now. I always said trouble would come of it. And sure enough, it did. It's priests of Hith that give the orders now, I'll wager. If you want my advice, you ought to go give Mr. Hamhand Oleg uh, that is a good talking to. He's most likely the source of all this trouble, if you ask me. Well, you could go talk to him right now. He lives uh, on the northwest side of town, just past the old library. Well, don't just stand there and go save the town with that Eric Strongbond turns to stare at the fire and begins whistling softly to himself. So, let's take a look. So we have a ring of deception and an iron scale now in the inventory. Uh, I didn't wanna... I wanted to leave like this. Thank you. So, I'm so glad that area view still doesn't work. The house is empty and dark. Let's go and uh, go to the north and an old man glares at you. Villagers shuffle by. This looks like the common room of an inn, but the woman at the hearth looks at you fearfully. I'm sorry, but you'll have to leave. You have no business here. Fearfully, she waits for you to leave. Fine, we leave then. To the, you hear bellowing to the north. I don't care about that. So, um... What is that here, I wonder? A dark and empty room. The town square is quiet. A few bedraggled villagers pass through with downcast eyes. Mm -hmm. So where do we go from here? We could... Oh. We could try to be inconspicuous. and walk in here. The empty library is a disaster of toppled shelves and trampled books. If we look around, there's a secret door to the east. The secret door is locked. What do you do? We knock. Genevieve truly opens the door. <laughs> that was awesome. A woman is sitting at a desk in this small windowless room. As we enter, she looks up. Who are you? What do you want? <coughs> We come from Ancelon to fight evil. I'm not sure I know what you speak of, but I deem you are of good heart. I'm Anthella, chief elder of this village. Will you aid us in our fight against the Sharkmen? Yes, I will. To truly help us, you must understand what has happened here in Bayor. 
This is recorded as journal entry 24. Let's see. Anthella. We had been holding off the Sharkmen for months, but then the Draconians came. They were well armed and organized, and soon killed all who resisted. When the fighting was over, they went north. They said they would breed more Draconians on the shores of the Lava Sea. It is a dreadful prospect. After the Draconians left, the Sharkmen began forcing us to build boats. Hundreds and hundreds of boats. I don't know why they want the boats. It makes no sense. Well, maybe they're planning an invasion over an ocean. We might have thrown off the yoke of the Sharkmen, but there are dragons in the woods to the north and no one dares to oppose them. You must not stay here. Go to the great gnome citadel of Aldin Aldin on the northwest of the Lava Sea. The gnomes are enemies of the minions of Heath. Perhaps they can stop the Draconians. I love Bayor deeply, but what is the good of fighting the Sharkmen if the Draconians will soon conquer all the lands? Go now and warn the gnomes. Do not incite the wrath of the dragons to the north, or there may be no one left when you return. No one left in Bayor. Fear not, we will slay the dragons. The party gains experience. Athena Anthela looks at you for a long time, then she gets a gleam in her eye. You know, I think you might, but first we should deal with the shockman. I will raise the town. Meet me in the square. She grabs a lantern and a short sword and runs out through the secret door. This would be this one here. Um, so we leave again, I think. Maybe we should encamp and save, just in case things go sour from here. But a few sharkmen shouldn't be a problem. The square is filled with the sound of battle. Things are not going well for the defending villagers, as the last remaining villagers turn to flee. You hear Anthela shouting, run, run for your lives! The sharkmen close in on you. Uh, they, they look interesting. Oh, there's a bunch of people. Oh, this is not nice. You attacked Genevieve Jolie. Fuck! Now you cannot cast. Um, use a want of fireballs then. Fuck off. Oh, I have to use it apparently like that. Manual on those annoying. Uh, I don't really know the range. It's probably the same. One. Two, three, four. Doesn't do much damage, but it prevents them from casting. You yell. I'd love to get a delayed blast fireball in this crowd. I actually can. Ah, well, this will turn the tide. Let's see. Um, one, two, three, four. Can I get more of them? One, two, three, four. Oh, that's cool. Uh. 
Oh, we are, out we, we are outside. The range isn't as large as I thought it would be. My mistake. Do it again. Let's see. One, two, three. That's enough. First I want to take out the spellcasters, as always. This is a good thing to do. Fine. If you want to play this in close range quarters, you can taste the long sword. Let's see. Hmm. What about you here, Black Rogue? Well, aim manual on him. Wrong button. Please in panic. Ha! Huh, stupid. Looks like they have enough. <laughs> Three people took a shot at him. And he's still alive. Done a manual. Cast a magic missile on him. So let's see, sixty forty one. I don't want them to get away if I can help it. <laughs> Escape is blocked, really? How unfortunate. Done view items. Um, get your U pack back. I think that's enough. Seventy thousand nine hundred sixty five experience points and Genevieve can level up. We take the money, twenty gems. And what do we get item wise? This is probably not magical, maybe the ringers, let's see, detect. Ring and braces. And that's about it. Good. No, I don't want the treasure, thank you. A delegation of town elders led by Anthella comes out of hiding. Thank you, brave newcomers. You have saved Bayer from the Sharkman. The town folk gather around and cheer. Someone shouts, speech, speech. Then everyone is shouting. Do you give a speech? Yes. Who will give it? Rackle Dorian will do it. Rackle Dorian gives a speech. You know, being a knight and all, she should be able to deal with the crowd. The people of Bayor look confused, but cheer wildly. 
as the cheering winds down, a villager suddenly gasps, What if the dragons to the north have seen what we've done? Will they kill us now? And Teller walks over and very quietly says, Good luck. Okay, well, we go in here again. This is an exceptionally good library of mundane books. The books have been put back on the shelves. Everything seems to be in order. We uh, knock. No one has... Oh! Knock means the spell, not to actually knock on the door. I get it. We pick it. <laughs> Kobitai picks it. We encamp, we fix, we rest. I thought, you know, somebody was knocking politely on the door. Oh well. That's why uh, the mage opened the door. I get it. So, that was fun. We encamp, we save. And we go to the north. Maybe we should... I don't know. No, I don't want to leave by your... Oh, not of a sudden area, work, area view does work. That's cool. Very well, what do we have here? Visitors, eh? Come a little closer, small creatures. I wish to make you feel welcome. Your time is ending, foul worm. A battle begins. Let's see, where are they? Not to the north, not to the south. Not to the west. There's one to the east. Is this the only one? Yeah, it looks like it. Can't be it though. It's just one dragon. Let's see, he has 46 hit points. You delay, you delay, you delay, you yell. You get out your dragon lance. And slay the beast. Continue the battle? No. Party has found no treasure. That was fun. You should also get out your dragon lance, I think. Oh. Don't take off the plate mail. Oh well, but it's late, so I guess we will um, deal with the other dragons in the next video. So thank you very much for watching, and see you soon. Bye.